and welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to create a journal with me video um, because I haven't created one of these videos in a while. If you want to see my creative process for my other journal pages, they've all been documented on this channel in a playlist called Journal With Me um, and I'll put the link in the description box below. I really enjoy creating these videos so let me know if you want to see more Journal With Me videos. So the last couple of weeks I've been really motivated to create my own business. Um, I've actually been working on this little side hustle for a while now and I finally, I'm finally kind of at a point where I'm like seeing it come to life in a way. So um, I knew I wanted to start a business a while ago and I actually created a subscription based e-commerce business um, with an old friend a while back. It was a bit of a failure. Um, but I learned a lot from it. So the failures really taught me how what not to do this time. So I'm excited because I started designing the website, creating the courses, and um, I've just been learning the ins and outs on online lead generation, and I love learning new skills, and um, there's so much you can learn on the internet these days for free, or at, like really little cost. So if you're also a person who has a little side hustle or is starting an online business, um, there's so many different ebooks out there, there's so many different online courses, and I've learned a lot from these courses and ebooks. So yeah, I really just wanted to launch this um, hopefully soon, so I'll let you guys know when it happens, because um, I tell you guys most things on this channel, I always update you, um, and hopefully I can quit my 9 till 5 job and pursue my side hustle full time one day. So. Yeah, does anyone else have a side hustle they're working on? I'd love to know. Let me know in the description box below. So on another note, it's been really cold here in Australia. I think it's probably been one of the coldest weeks. Um, I finally changed the doona on the bed and I got out the heater out of the cupboard and finally warming this place up. Um, I'm sure our winter is a lot warmer than many other countries. Um, we still have so many beautiful days here and it's usually just the breeze that's cold. Um, we don't get a lot of gloomy days. It's either sunny and cold or rainy and cold. It's not usually dark and cold like other places get. Um, and usually I only have to put on a pair of jeans and a jumper. Um, I've always wanted a white Christmas though. So one day I'll be able to have a white Christmas and finally um, tick that off the bucket list. Um, I've only ever seen snow twice. Once at a school camp, we went skiing, I think probably like in 2004 or five. Um, and the other time was in New York. I went with my partner l early last year, I think it was. Um, we had a snow fight in um, Brooklyn over the Brooklyn Bridge. I think we're actually under the Brooklyn Bridge having a snow fight. So I'll put that on the screen, the link in the screen, if you want to see that video and also put it in the description box. It was such a fun trip. I documented the entire trip um, just like I did with Japan, but a lot of you guys watched my Japan series and not my American series. So I'll put that link in the description box below in case you guys want to check out um, the videos I created in America. I got a bit off track there. Oh yeah, my sister gave birth. She's... Um, she had a little baby boy, I think, two, three nights ago now. So I am officially an auntie again. If you don't already know, I have three older sisters. Um, and I'm going to be visiting my sister Beck soon. And I'll film a little bit of footage for you guys so you can see my little little nephew. He's going to be so cute. He's, I've seen a few some photos. He's so small. He's got a teeny tiny nose and all. Oh, I can't wait to go give him a big hug. Yeah, so what was I saying? Oh yeah, I spoke to my mother and grandmother on the phone. They were asking me um, how many letters I received around the world and if I knew all the places I'd received letters from. And I wasn't too sure um, where I'd received letters from because I've received letters from so many different places. So I'm going to buy one of those scratch maps and um, I'm going to scratch all the countries I've received letters from and I'm going to try to receive letters from every country in the world. So I'm going to see what countries I haven't received letters from and see if you guys can help me out, see if you know anyone. Um, and I thought it'd be a really fun challenge to try to receive a letter from every country in the world. So this will be a, a collective community project that we'll all have to see if we can think of someone who lives in a country that I haven't received letters from. So. Um, yeah, and also, I I don't know if I told you guys on my main channel yet, but um, 
If you haven't heard already, we located one of the traveling notebooks. It's on its way through South America and it's heading up to the United States. So I can't wait for it to come back to Australia. I'm gonna be so excited um, when it comes back to Australia and when I can finally open it up and show you guys all the notes and cute things that people have put in there um, for me, for us I should stay, say. You guys will be able to um, see what's inside. And yeah, I think that was everything I wanted to tell you guys today. Um, so yeah, I'll buy one of those scratch maps soon and um, hopefully we can start that challenge um, within the next month and I'll bring you guys with me when I go up to see my sister and her little baby boy so um, I'm an auntie and I'm so excited to see my little bubba and yeah I'll put those links in the description box below if you want to check out any more of my journal with me videos or if you wanted to see my trip around America so thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed this video today um, and I'll speak to you next week. Thanks for watching. Bye.